Today I'm going to show you how to make this tuna broccoli casserole recipe that's easy, cheesy, creamy, low carb, keto friendly and makes a lovely budget friendly dinner. And I've written a blog post which I'll leave down below which has the full recipe, step by step instructions and loads of ideas for adaptations, extra ingredients you can include in your tuna broccoli casserole so click through for that. And be sure to leave a like, subscribe for more videos, comment to let me know if you give this a try and what you think of it. So let me show you all the ingredients and then show you how to make it. First we gather all of our ingredients together. I'm using double cream but you could use any cream you like. We've got cheese which I'm going to grate, broccoli, tuna and sour cream. That's it in this beautiful broccoli and tuna casserole. Start by chopping up all the broccoli into bite-sized pieces and pop it into a dish which you can pop into the oven. And then top the chopped broccoli with a tin of tuna, whatever size you like. The more tuna you use, the more tuna there'll be in your broccoli casserole. And then mix the broccoli and tuna through together and pour over a third of a cup of cream and a third of a cup of sour cream and give that all a really good mix through to get it fully distributed till it's lovely and mixed through just like that. Just make sure you get every last bit mixed through together. And then for the cheese, we'll mix a third of the cup through so there's cheese mixed through every single bite full. And then top the rest of the casserole with the other third of a cup of cheese or you can do really as much cheese as you like. And then we're going to pop our finished dish into the oven, preheated to 180 degrees Celsius, which is 350 Fahrenheit for 20, 25 minutes, maybe even half an hour. depends on how cheesy and crisp you want it. And there you go. It's out the oven. It's so crisp and cheesy and it kind of tastes like a cross between a cheesy tuna melt and tuna noodle casserole. It's just full of veggies and just such a yum meal. But that is the video for today. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe for more videos and comment too. And we'll see you again soon. Bye.